Oh, always on just dumps it on the the ground the sprayer's on. In this case, that small island, which is a waste. Well, that's dumb. Hey, there's the farber key that I need to grab. All right, we've arrived at the Antier system. As it was last called, sensors are off the charts and need recalibrating. What's the source of the interference? It isn't interference, it's information. There are billions of data streams across billions of channels, all carrying vast amounts of data. It's too... it's too much. Shut down the sensors, Leah. Do it now. Leah! The data streams. I have the sensors shut down now. The amount of information being transmitted was incalculable. Scars. It was blinding to my gel circuits. I've never encountered anything as complex and ordered. And on such a scale. Could you determine anything about the signals? Their source? Their content? Their purpose? Signals appear to be coming from everywhere, focused on the system. It's like someone encoded quadrillions of Yoda bytes of data into the background radiation of the universe. It's near the quantum limit for information density. What's in the message? Did you ascertain anything? It seems to be everything. Scars. Just everything. I don't understand. Everything of what? Everything that has ever been. It's ex exact state information. It's... Think of it like a very precise plan for how to make everything that's ever existed. Every leaf on every tree that has ever existed on every world, every grain of sand, every star, every molecule of every atmosphere that has bent the light of its star into a sunset. Do this. Enable visual spectrum sensors only for the system. Let's look at the system with just our eyes. Okay, looks like two worlds, one shielded, one not. My records indicate these worlds were last called Otrav and Farber. There's nothing particularly remarkable about either world over the last few billion years. You said the sensor streams seem to be focused on the system. Any particular region in this system? Yes, good question. In the time I sampled the streams, they appear to be... That's interesting. The focus appears to be changing slightly. So that the signals are at their peak over Farber. The signal focus is somehow tracking the orbit of that world. And that's where we're headed, Leah. The Loki must be behind these signals, and this world must be significant somehow. I'll attempt to install some filters on the sensors so I can better sample the streams. That should allow us to perhaps learn something more about the intent of the signals. Well, I don't have, and pick up any shield keys there. Otrav. Hey, thank you, Arbitrated Sean, for the 25 bits. Hello. This world is covered in tech, and none of it looks friendly. It is tech, that's for sure. It doesn't appear to be directed towards any offensive or defensive purpose, though. That's odd. Since most civilizations were interested in defending themselves and the Creeper is interested in destroying them, this world has been designed to concentrate Creeper on each hill top in sequence. That old Tycon facility at the east is projecting dual attraction fields that rove over the terrain. What purpose is there in concentrating Creeper like that? It makes it harder to destroy, but this world doesn't appear configured for defense. Anything to do with the intense signals you have detected focused on the system. Focus your scanners on a hilltop. Scanning. This is interesting and subtle. It seems that the structure on each hill is designed as a transmitter. When the creeper pulls over a transmitter, I assume, that is when each will transmit. And this is where the signal in the system is coming from? Absolutely not. Well, some tiny fraction of it, perhaps. The signals in the system must be coming from billions of other worlds, like this one, all transmitting at the same time. It's the Loki. Must be. Everything over the last 10 billion years. Their campaign to destroy everything in this universe with the Creeper. It's been building up to this. Scars. If all the Creeper from across the universe is the source of the signals, it means the Creeper doesn't just destroy things. It also remembers things in exacting detail. It would only be bound by the uncertainty principle unless we're going to destroy those transmitters, that field projector, and collect the shield key from this world. You must reach the next world in the system and discover what the Loki are doing. Hi. Okay, so... Looks like this is my side. Everything... Oh, are some of those moving? That's a spook. Okay, I'm just going to do that. Get my field at. Hopefully, these things don't spread too far. Is 
video. Yeah, let's see if we can get some guns out here. Looks like it's going to be coming for me on that this side here. Let's go back, grab a siphon. Looks like I'm going to have to work my ass off if I'm going to want to be able to get up to one of these things to get this. Uh, I might be able to do it. Okay, let's just do that for a second. So obviously this thing is not sufficient in the slightest. But there's only two primary channels that the creep's even going to be coming through to getting uh, to get at me on this side. So I might be able I might be able to kind of block it here. How much power do I have? I've got an amount. I don't have any efficiency upgrades, but it seems like it's in my best interest to start getting a bunch of reactors out anyway. Dilly dally too long. Okay, uh, let's see. Didn't need another one there. Alright, energy is looking good. Okay, it's going to just start spilling over everything, though, in it. We're going to need a bunch of guns. Well, it's a good thing I got a lot of this stuff down early. might redline it a little. Alright, so we've got sufficient guns. Let's just get enough reactors that we can keep them off of me. And probably one mortar here. Anywhere where it's getting kind of deep, we gotta get that. Okay, uh, let's see. So back to back to this. One reactor at a time. Because if I can keep up with the uh, if I can keep up with the rate that they're outputting at, and get my power into the green, we can at least daisy chain a couple of shield generators into this immediate area and not have too much trouble. Ooh, pushing it here a bit. I wish I knew what my full deficit was. It's bad. I know that much. Okay, that's keeping it off. Alright, that's... Kind of keeping it back. I know this is my current drain, but I wish it would actually show me how much I need uh, to fully, fully fulfill my required energy costs. Okay. So I could use probably just one more regular cannon here.
All right. I think we're we're keeping up with it. So now we just start getting a ton of ton of power. So it's the uh it is the red bar, so I I need at least 10 more power to comfortably be able to power this whole base. Well, I guess this is just going to be how it goes. Solving this power situation should let me push him back. I mean, I think we're okay. Yeah, the biggest issue here... Oh, we're not getting nearly enough power out, out to these guys. Hence why they're struggling so hard. That is freaking dire. Let's see. Would you want to power uh, pause a few cannons here and there? I don't think I can afford to. Like, I need actually all of this. So what we're going to do is just hold the line, which is holding. And just slowly build one generator, generator at a time. Okay, I just have to make sure I don't have two in progress simultaneously. Because you notice as, as the uh, the deficit drops slowly. Uh, where will we go? Move the hubs around? No. Why? That's not going to help me. And I'm not going to need to restart. We got this. It looks bad, but like, have some faith in me. It's super, it's usually super obvious if I need to restart or not, and that's usually because I forgot about spores. Luckily, there's no spores in this map, so I'm, I'm all good. Hey, we're starting to see a net positive here. Look at that, power grid's, power grid's back to where it needs to be. Yeah, spores would have killed me ten times over. Yeah, with a map like this... Not really sure what I would have been able to do better if I had had to deal with spores. Because, yeah, you're completely correct. They would have killed the shit out of me. The problem is... How do you... Not get the shit killed out of you? Okay. So we're going to have to daisy chain a lot of shields, I think. Okay, what are we at? We're doing decent. My drain is still pretty high. Like it looks like I've I'm doing well. I am, but I'm I'm riding a thin line. I think I'm just going to wait before I do anything terribly distract uh terribly drastic and mostly just focus on getting a solid uh, uber heap of reactors. Let's see, what is my drain? We're actually riding, we're riding it right now. All right, and we're back up. Just plonk those down. All right, now let's take a look at this. Hopefully this is enough power. Yeah, I've got three times surplus. So let's get a shield generate. No, 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 no. Let's get a turp. So what floor is that? Seven. So we want to go up to eight. I mean, honestly, screw it. Let's go up to 10. This stuff normally. 5, 1. Okay. 
get like two more Terps if I can possibly jam them up in here. And then other than that, we should probably get some relays. not the prettiest setup, but that should move things around a lot better. Alright, next up, let's grab, grab that one. Let's go back up to seven. I know I was doing five, but five is actually too thin. Seven seems to be perfect, because that way I can get uh, relays up in, up in here. There we go. Okay, so this is going to take a little while, but I can effectively extend a lance up in here and start disabling things up and down this. You need three, six, nine for platforms, but you don't have six. It's super annoying, yeah. I, I will I will fully agree agree with that. But like I'll take what I can get. Let's see, did I build that shield generator? I did not. I wonder if I destroy one of these, if the white circle will still go there. All right, let's go up to nine. That way I can fit multiple things, have a central row. I'll have to, I'll have to destroy this. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'll just do it now. There we go. Yeah, that way I can have an advance of three constantly. It's going to take a little while longer for the Terps to actually, you know, do their work. But that's fine. Alright, we'll just kind of hang out here. At least for a little while. I can't imagine this game without Terps. Uh, the Creeper World 4 demo currently has no Terps. And so when I first started playing this, I was just like, I don't need Terps. They seem silly. And then it's like, holy shit, I need Terps. Okay. Uh, let's start getting some mortars up in here. I don't think we need them else. I don't think we need them up here as much. At least not quite as much. Okay, next up, move the shield generator. Woo, Terp, Terp was lost. So this is getting a little deep for me. Um, I guess we got a couple of options. Easy one is old habits. Because yeah, this is too deep. So I'm gonna just do a strafing run down this and have the Terps keep working.
Okay. Because that should keep the flaw off the top and take everything else off the top too while we're at it. that one. Move this forward. Okay. Move that there. So I think we're just going to have to hold the line for a moment. We need to get a factory. Not a factory. We need to get a forge. Not the best spot to put it here, but we'll be okay. Ooh. Okay, it was just that. It was probably because they all had to reload. It's fine. We're about to we're about to solve all of our problems and more. Very slowly. We only have one of these. I'd like to get the other one. Oh, right. Now that I'm thinking about it. Structure. Uh, weapons? Nullifier. Can I can I nullify this? I can. Okay, cool. Because if I can get rid of this one, I'm not even sure what this thing does. But it should keep one of the white circles off at the very least. And give me a, a good a big spot to use as a, uh, a platform for myself. We could try a super shield generator, but I don't... I think I want to go for a super, uh, super mortar. Yeah, that, that helps tremendously. So the white circle will not go to the empty, empty spot anymore. Alright. Solve my power in, like, two fell swoops. It honestly doesn't take much. All right. Let's just do super mortar right there. Okay, we'll do a bit on packet speed. Should be good. It's still a pickle, but we're getting it done. Uh, let's see, how's my energy doing? Oh right, my energy doing, my energy is doing insanely well, so I don't have to worry about that. Let's just get some more guns up in here, because I've got at least a couple of guns that I can shift up as well. Now let's go forge. Let's do fire rate. These can shoot a little faster. There we go. That's what I need. Okay, so let's, let's keep doing what we were doing. Pushing further forward. Uh, let's see. Weapons, no fire. Do I have enough? No. So it's got to be... It's got to be at least a smidge further. But then we can make some small annexes and start going after the things along this line. I think we're good. Uh, let's see. Does Wander have Singularity? I don't have Singularity yet. We probably unlock that after the next world. Would be my assumption. I, I actually have zero way of knowing. Okay, can I get a nullifier here? So if I can if I can wipe out both of these, 
that opens everything up. Format back up here. Give myself some sufficient space. Uh, let's see. Mortar over here. Hopefully, it will let me clear that out. All right. Take the planes. Where's our next target? This one. I want to get this kind of down, and I'm just going to go for the spread shot method. Alright, these two don't have anything to do. This one doesn't have anything to do. This one looks pretty bored, too. Alright, let's go back to the forge. Fire rate and a little bit into range. Oh, that works wonders. Uh, let's see. So once now that we're done with that, let's get... Let's, let's turp up. this one here. I guess we honestly don't need the shield generator nearly as much as we used to. Uh, let's see, Terraforma. Uh, let's actually do nine. Centered around this one. I'm just going to do a series of level 10 platforms, uh, just kind of going all over the place. My thoughts are... Let's see, we don't need move, move speed. Probably just want to do fire rate. My thoughts are they can't reach us very well if we're above them, because uh, they have generally have to flow around. So easier for me... Ooh, yeah, e easier for me to build a Bertha at this point. Next relay there. Let's see. This seems like a good spot for the shield generator. Let's see. Is anything else bored? These guys are getting bored. They are they are probably quite bored. Let's just do another big mortar here. Just let it do its thing. Uh, let's see. What's the next thing that's threatening me? I guess this one. Oh, wait, no. It's this. But I think I'm just gonna I'm gonna just stick to the stick to the plan. Do my usual. Okay, terraforma back up to this. Keep extending this way. Right. Grab these. Yeah, between all of the between all of these weapons, we've got uh, got a lot more leeway for just wrecking wrecking shop. Back to three. I'm just going to kind of extend. Uh, let's see. Let's just do that there. My goal truly is just to have as many of these kind of pathways. Because look at this. It's so much easier now. I mean, there's... There is the potential that I'm going to screw something up and everything's going to go real bad real fast. But I doubt it. Alright. Weapons. Nullifier. I can just put it here. What about over here? Yes, we just need a relay. It's not the best system. But it works. Okay, let's just grab all of these and then pile them down this direction. We gotta get another terraform. Alright, let's just have a turbo gun there. Alright, relay at the end. Make sure they have enough power. Let's see. Secondary relay? Eh. 
Secondary relay, that way I can pull that in. We've got enough upgrade bits that I'm not too worried, but seeing as we're just committing holy war upon everything in our immediate area. Uh, it's not forge. Terraform, back up to a nine. Probably gonna put a, a Bertha up there. It's a little too tall. Or it's a little too far away from anything else of any use. Alright, we got this. The secret weapon is Terp. Let's see, spread that out. Yeah, because I see like three major, ex uh, extremely major, extremely vulnerable locations that I can just start abusing. Speaking of, more Terp. Okay. These guys aren't needed here anymore. Let's start hurting this one. Whoops. Didn't mean to shift that there. Well, it's okay. How gutsy do I feel? Do I feel gutsy enough for that? Okay. That was officially two guts. gonna bug me. What level is this? This is level 6. Cool. Get back down there. I'm gonna fix some of the holes in the environment as I go by. Because I can. and Because I have nothing else. Okay. Cool. Bertha. Done. Don't actually have enough power for it. How the hell and why the heck? I guess I'll just put a collector there. Alright, is that a... Yeah, that's actually an enemy spawner right there. Go figure I'm not able to really get anything in the immediate area. Let's just, uh... Let's just do that. And this area is just... We have successfully bullied this into oblivion. Look at this. I've got, like, three things I can just... do horrible, horrible stuff to. Whoops. So that's... Uh. I guess I could just move the other shield generator down. I noticed that one. Or, I totally missed that one. Alright. So I think the biggest issue is I actually have to destroy this. I was trying to be cheeky. Let's see, did I get all of these? Yes. Put that there. I might be able to just wreck this one without actually putting any immediate effort in. Kind of true of a couple of these. If there's no immediate spawner, I can, I can just kind of nuke it. Well, this... This quickly just flipped in my favor. As soon as I got rid of, like, the first couple ones on a hill... I lost a relay somewhere. Oh, probably this one. Yep. I'll just pause, pop the collector. Okay. Next up, nullifier. I guess I can just put it there. It'll be safer in that immediate area. Nope. Ten, nine. Okay, let's just fill that out. Expand further down. This one upsets me. But that's okay. Alright, terraforming's looking good. Everything is everything is in my favor. Let's just move the Legion of Terps southward. And make this land mine. Okay. 
So, do we change strats, or do we just keep going kind of full aggro here? This area, yeah, this area is covered, at least for the moment. Air form, brush size, three. Okay, move him there. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Look at this thing. It's just like, die! I love it. Alright. Yeah, let's just... Let's just finish the wall. There. Now pretty much my entire base can just be uh, shifted closer. Because at, at this point, they're not getting, getting past this wall. Let's go for fire rate, a little bit of range, and some movement speed. There we go. That's the stuff. I'm not even using, like nearly close to capacity. I moved that one over there. Titans, Bertha. Make it a Bertha? Bertha. Uh, let's see. Move these closer. I think... Is this Bertha? Okay, this Bertha is actually firing. Uh, seems like that one's... Kind of one of the last major areas that's still shooting at me. Okay. Legion of Terps. Well, it doesn't even really need to be on the platform anymore. It can just be kind of a nebulous cloud of Terps. Well, could be. Except for this is hitting our power supplies way worse than I thought it was going to. Turns out firing all, ter all terps all the time is uh, bad. Luckily, there's actually nothing left to fear. It might also be the egregious amount of... Uh... Might be the egregious amount of uh, birth is firing as well. I, I'm i sure there's a lot of reasons why my, my power grid is suddenly starting to have issues. I think... Oh yeah, that's the spawner in there. <laughs> Bullying. Oh, let's see. Structure. Relay. Oops. You get out of here, heretic. Shift forward. Bring on the Terps. Right, there we go. Weapons, nullifier. Other nullifier. What is this thing? I don't know. Alright. And now everybody bully the snap out of this thing. Let's see. Well, do I... Just continue south? This is gonna get sloppy. Uh, let's see. Terraform... Let's actually... Let's not. There we go. That's faster. Holy crap, that's faster. Alright. Relay. Other relay. Descend. There we go. That should that should keep it busy. Long enough for me to toss this on, and we're good. How many terps is that? Critical mass. It's a critical mass of terps. Like there's anything else on this planet. Yeah, it looks like the light circles are just totally, totally bailed. It wasn't worth it for them.